Okay. And we got some stuff to go. I got um, a thing of 10 traditional bone-in uh, buffalo wings for $12.99. 12-inch meat bone cheese sub for $12.99. It came with chips. And then um, a thing of jalapeno power for $6.99 with ranch. And I got ranch with uh, uh, wings too. I don't know how much my to go stuff was offhand. I got the 12 inch Philly steak and then I got fat chicks. Fat chicks. Fat chick sandwich. They had frog chicken legs. sandwich with uh, <coughs> mushrooms and onions and cheese. They got the good, they have frog legs here. They got bacon wrapped scallops and a whole bunch of good oh, stuff. Miss frog we gotta get here, go here again. This place is cool. Yeah. And yeah, hopefully, hopefully everything will be awesome. Well, Okay. So, uh, the reason why I thought of this place is because my cousin's husband posted something. I guess Wednesdays they do pizza and wing buffets. And, my, and he posted it on Facebook. Oh, hey, I keep forgetting about that. Jason, I got to go there. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever been here. I've never have. been here. I've never been here before. So, oh, well. if here we come, try it out. We got stuff to eat here. Yeah. I don't know if I'll finish my <laughs> burger. It's all oh, of meat. Because it's three patties. Yeah. It's a. Uh, wow. And they're all thirds. So one's uh, elk, one's buffalo, and one's boar. Yeah. So I'm that's see. twenty ninety nine. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I gotta try it next time. But they said every day takeout special: large one topping pizza and sixteen wings for twenty five bucks. That's not bad. Right behind you. Nice. That's not a bad deal. Okay. And we'll be back with food. A little bit. Thanks. Uh, okay. For a thumbnail right here. Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? Um, I'm doing great. <laughs> I'm with my buddy John, and we went to uh, Wagon Wheel and uh, Wagon Wheel Bar and Grill. Never been there before. Very happy uh, with the food and with the uh, um, portion sizes. And we got some stuff to go. And I reviewed uh, one thing. He got the fat chick. I gave him some wings for that. I haven't done my review of the wings. I might do that uh, tomorrow at home. Um, right now, I want to do a review of the meatball sub because I always have to try. I love meatball subs, so I always have to try meatball subs at different places see if they're any good. And uh, this was a foot long. I think there was eleven ninety. I thought it was twelve ninety. I think it was eleven ninety nine, right? And I got a thing of. I had jalapeno poppers with ranch, and these were six ninety nine. One, two, three, four, seven. So like a dollar. They're they're big though. They're big though. And I know, you know I got that, and I got them in the styrofoam container. Now the sub came in this old school submarine thing. I remember these for I remember that one. There's a place in Albion called. Uh, there's a place called Reed Sub Shop. I never, I remember going there a long time ago. Uh, and getting a couple of subs. I got hot sausage sub and, but they just got stuff from Surefine and stuff on there. So it wasn't like, it was all right. I mean, it just seems like every time the owners have an attitude, so I don't go there. I went there once or twice. And that was a long, long time ago. It's been a while. So let's go ahead and try the meatball sub. Meatballs are pretty regular size. Meat on cheese sub with sauce and cheese. Let's try it out. Mm. Marinara sauce is very good. Meatballs are decently seasoned. Um I always have more sauce on it, but that's just me. But there is a decent amount of sauce on these. And it's pretty much full. And uh, the meatballs are like all the way in the sub. Both sides. Or a little bit 
Yeah, you know, pretty much. I'm very impressed. Probably give it a eight out of ten. I'm gonna try the jalapeno poppers. Very big. Come on. Mmm. Cheddar cheese. You want to try a jalapeno popper? Yeah, no. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I'm gonna get cold. Mm. Really good with the cheddar and stuff on it. I like it with the slice of jalapeno right there. It's not super spicy. Mmm. That's really good. I'm going to play I give it like a 9 out of 10. John Cena up here is going to try his out too. Huh? John Cena up here is going to try his out too. John Cena's? What? John's eating his up too. He needs a jalapeno popper out. Not right now. Oh, not right now? Okay. I got toast going. Oh, okay. I can only have one thing going at a time, or those circuit breaker chips. Oh, really? Mm. Yeah, it's got too many things plugged into the one section. I got you, buddy. This is one of the old houses that people that put shit together didn't do it, right? Yeah. A lot of the times, the old... I remember my grandmother um, passed away. She had a... I think when she had to resell the house, she said she had to get it rewired or something like that. Because that was like a house from like the old 1900s. Mm-hmm. But I mean, my grandma never used a whole lot of electricity, though. But I mean, it seemed like everything worked fine, though. Mm. John Cena piss. I said John Cena. It sounded like I said John Cena. This thing sounded like that. Yeah, but pretty good stuff. I mean, I like their food there. Um, they put a lot of meatballs in here, which I like. All right, be careful. Not bad. Then, yeah, I think they're pretty good. Yep. Well, they're pretty big though, too, you know. All right. They got a whole bunch of stuff, like you said, crab legs, they got frog legs. Yeah, I hope, I mean, I'm really impressed with that place. It's pretty good. I said about eight or nine. Yeah, uh, I wanted her to say, do you serve crab? And he said, sit down, sir, or we serve anybody. <laughs> oh, God, there you go. <laughs> oh, careful. And I got some ranch to go with it. I mean, Ranch is fine and be a disappointment, but I mean the ranch is okay, I guess. So that's it for my review of the uh, meatball Ooh. sub and the jalapeno poppers. And John tried his, yeah. Oh, right. That cheese get a little bit hot. <laughs> so, but, but like I said, I loaded it up with cheese and perfectly breaded and stuff. I remember that one place I used to work at, we did we made jalapeno poppers. The cheese would always cook out of it. When you put it in the deep fryer, you have to be super careful with it. Oh, yeah. They, this is the breading is fine. It kept the cheese in there great and stuff. Yeah, it's a great place. A wagon wheel, uh, bar and grill. So I guess that's it, everybody. Till next time, everybody, please. Take care of my legion. Awesome. Jason Callen, your YouTube channel kicks ass. Everyone should go and subscribe to Jason freaking Callen, the hot sauce king pin of them all. Yeah.
Ooh. Action shot. Good night, my legion! Yeah!